They started practicing about four months ago, and uh, they've been after it uh, with their practicing, and it, and it really uh, paid off, you know, in the games. They've improved every week in, in all areas of uh, fielding and hitting, and so that's a credit to the coaches and a credit to them. I attended a few practices and also attended the games, and, and uh, one of the things I really, uh, really saw in them was that the coaches made it a lot of fun, and yet they really pushed and, and tried to maximize you know, the effort out of the girls. And uh, the girls responded well to the coaches, and, and, uh, and I, you know you see the results of that, 11 and 0. Hit up three, hit up three, one, two, three, hit. Just to to see them excel makes us feel proud, and makes us feel good for them, and so it's always a blessing. Most of the parents, you know, when I look around and talk to them, you know, they played ball themselves, and and so it's it's good to see that it's. Uh, being carried on in our in our siblings, I I think uh, being undefeated uh, for the Seminoles uh, once again they were unconquered. You know, having an undefeated season is, is something that they can uh, grab hold of and and, sh and look back as they get older and say, hey, we we went all the way with no no one could beat us. You know, and so I, I think it's a major accomplishment for them in their in their young lives and. And I think they can uh, go from there and maybe do even better things. Go team! <laughs> go team! Someone lighting one.